Splendor Happy Book, which told people to count 15 blessings every hour and to rejoice about something every quarter hour. And then the next activism was when Cablevision took the program off of the TV because I said the Commissioner of Consumer Affairs should take away Scott Lord's license for operating an underground lawn sprinkling business without a Consumer Affairs permit and the, under information and belief, the supervisor of Nassau County told Cablevision to take Lindor off the TV. And in that they did that very night and uh, the court ruled that plaintiff, plaintiff Glendora had a statutory right to be on TV and must be put back on the TV. Then the next activism were many lawsuits over 20 years brought into the courts and I found out that the judges were crooked and the lawyers were corrupt and the clerks were lying. So that was the next activism to sue judges on the basis that they purged their oath to support the Constitution of the United States. The current activism is, do you believe in miracles? We came from Albany, New York today. You believe in miracles? Here's a miracle. We found a parking space. And uh, the, uh, the, and now the activism is happiness. That there's no reason to be unhappy. That if you just stop and count your blessings, you'll realize how happy you are. And don't complain. A man was worried about his daughter getting married, his fourth daughter. And his friend said, why? He said, well, my first daughter married a man from Singleton, Missouri, and they had one child. My second daughter married a man from Twin Oaks. New Hampshire and they had two children and my third daughter married a man from Three Rivers, Michigan and they had three children. Why are you worried about your fourth daughter getting married? She's going with a guy from the Thousand Islands. 